So we are starting to do the medicine bottles today and I'm really excited we're about to spray paint them. Um, it's also my first time using spray paint which is cool. Um, we're going to spray paint the caps gold and the bodies of them white so that anything that we put on top of it will stand out a little bit more um, and it will be more opaque and have like, you won't be able to see like inside the bottle, you know what I mean? So it's like all covered um, and we're going to do 10 of them. Nine to make into kits and the one to make a maraca. <laughs> for fun. We're gonna do it actually outside on a picnic table with some painter's plastic laid down I think so that we can stay clean and we can do it outside so it's in a well ventilated area which is important to not die. soaking it in hot water and just scraping them off. Casey, you okay? How's your leg? Something that we do have to be careful of though is the wind as it moves. So we have to kind of wait for it to die down a little. The gold is so pretty. Everything's a bit of a mess. We still gotta do the sides as well of the caps. Right, so we're just going in for a second coat on everything, cleaning everything up and taking them inside, waiting for them to dry. So we have a piece of paper that is the exact surface area of the bottle. So we cut that first, and then we're going to use this to create a template, the cardboard, that also is the same size as the medicine bottle, so that we can cut um, our more decorative paper to then finish off the project. So it's multi-layered. Just traced it using this pencil on the template. And we're gonna cut it out. So I'm doing this piece now, the elephants, more like this, because this one really strikes me. step is to take the cutouts that we cut out of the different papers well we're using two different kinds and we're going to fit them around the medicine bottles and mod podge them on First one 